guys welcome back to the channel and to another video in this video i've got two centrifugal pump impellers to balance let me show you the impellers and then um, let me carry on okay so i have this two centrifugal centrifugal pump impellers that i must balance they're the same model centrifugal pumps i'm just busy sticking this one onto the shaft here and then i'm going to capture all the data and stuff off this one and if i say dart i'm talking about the size this wearing this wearings um diameter here you know the depth of the impeller the outside the amateurs all that kind of stuff so i'm just setting that one up on the shaft now um ready to go on the machine over there and um then i'll capture all this data all right so she's mounted onto the shaft i'm just going to set this machine up now because this machine is still set up onto the double plane which you can see over here so i'm just setting this up now to for the um, impellers and then we'll start on this one Okay, so what you couldn't see is I was just busy setting this slot up at the back here, the end stops here. So I'm just going to put this end stop. This must just be loosened up here and drag closer. I must put the putty in, my reflector tape, and then um, she's ready to go. Alright, so this I got number one in and this year is number two lane of year. So she's all set up now in stops are all in it's black uh, reflector tape is on there, putty everything. And I'ma just like I said earlier, I'ma just turn this to single plane because that is still set for that, which I'm sure you saw in a previous video. Because I made a, a video on that also. So anyway, let's just um, check how unbalanced this thing is. Actually, before I do all of that, I must first set the computer up. Okay, so she's ready to be calibrated. I press OK now and um, we'll start the machine. Okay, she's on the machine. She's now running at 228. So I can start cranking up a little bit. Okay, so there she's running, she's at balancing speed, she's 51 grams out at 32, so she's not actually too bad. Okay, let's just print this quickly. Okay, so there we have it, 100-400, bronze impeller, 51 grams, 32 degrees, unqualified, okay, let's work on this one. 
Okay, so I gave her another run and um, she came up as 33 degrees 51. So it's just one degree out. It's still 51 grams. Um, so let's go to 33 degrees. And I'll just turn this here. You can see she's moving there. I'm actually past. There's 33 degrees. So somewhere on top here is where I must take off weight. I'm going to mark this now and I'm going to start grinding. Okay guys, so um, after I printed, after I done the printout and I showed you guys the printout, I thought that I had the camera running, but unfortunately she was not recording. And what you missed and what I failed to capture was when I done the static roll, you know, I normally statically roll my objects that I have balanced, my impellers that I have balanced just to see where the where the weights fall, you know, like when the heavy parts at the bottom. Well, that's what I didn't show you. And um, like I said, I thought I was recording it, but yeah, well, anyway. So yeah, so you didn't catch, you didn't catch that. Um, but we'll carry on with the video and I'll show you where I had to grind to get it to, to lay like she should. Right, let's carry on. Okay, so this one needed actually quite a bit of grinding. I had to grind there. I had to grind here, but I couldn't grind too much on this face because this this vein was quite thin here. So I had to come to the back end here as well and grind here. So let's just check this thing out quickly. Let's call that um, that top and let's give it a spin. And let's just quickly see how how out she is. If she is good enough to be dynamically balanced now. She's coming to a bit of a slowdown. Let's just check if, if it just stops. Obviously, like I said in my other videos, guys, the idea is it must just stop. It mustn't want to want to move afterwards. Like it must just stop and she mustn't roll back or anything. Okay, that's good enough. So I'm going to stick it on the machine now. Right, so I got a, I got the running. She's at uh, 300 revs now. Let's just quickly see how much, how far she's out. We come up to balancing speed. Okay, there we go, 500, so we're 28.7 grams out at 15 degrees. Let's bring her closer to the center. Okay, so she's running again. <coughs> we're down to 3.67. Um, so I grinded this thing at, at least thrice to get to this one, so I'll keep on going. Alright, she's just coming to a standstill. This one I brought now down to 1.35, so she's actually good, but I'll, as we all know by now, I like to take it to less than half a gram, so I'm going to work it closer. Okay, so there we go, guys. She's all, she's all balanced up. 504 revs, that's all, that's all fine. She's good. She's 0 0.29, so let's print this. Okay, so here we have the before, she was 51 at um, 32 degrees and here we have after 0 0.29 at 211 degrees. So she's all good to go. This one is done. Let's carry on with number two. Okay guys, so I'm going to start at number two now, but I'm not going to still show you all the weighing of the impellers and stuff like that. I, obviously I weighed number one and all the kinds of stuff like that. So um, I'm not going to still show you me capturing all the data 
on um, impeller number two I'll just go past all of that and you'll join me when number two is on the shaft ready for balance okay let's go okay this, so this is number two going up to speed here yeah, she's at basically 500 so she's, uh, this is 42.12 at 328 degrees so let's print this and um, and start start balancing it all right so here we go this is the uh, the second one 42 at 328 so I'll start balancing this. I'm not going to still do a static on this one because it's only 42 is not too bad. I can just work that down. So, okay, let's go. Right, I've done my first, my first grind. You can actually see the little flash there. Let's see what it is. It was 42 when I started. Let's just see. I'm going up to the speed. Okay, there we go. I took off half, half of it now. So we're getting there. Right. So this is two grinds later, and let's see where we are. It's coming up to speed. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're down to twelve now, and she, you can see she's creeping closer and closer. I'm going to carry on, and now goalies over there all right we 1.95 grams at 330 this is once again two grinds or three grinds later and I'll obviously get it a bit closer okay guys there we have it number two I think I grinded probably about 10 times or something like that and there we go 0 0.36 504 revs Let's stop and print this. All right. Number two, this is when we started, was 42 grams at 328. Brought it down to 0 0.36 at 296. So she's good to go. Job done. Okay, guys, so that's me done with this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, I kind of just showed the basic outline of how we do, how I do this balancing. And I try to keep it as informative and as exciting as it suppose it could be. So if you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up and comment. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers for now.